Hello, back in the car again. Um, I hope that's not too annoying for people, but it's convenient for me to do on a Thursday when I'm driving around because I've got a long day and um, it keeps my attention focused. I'm never gonna get out of this junction. Oh, someone's letting me out, thank you. But I want to talk about what owners, <laughs> what owners done now. So a little while ago, they started trailing an announcement, which, due to the fact that there was a guy in the advert holding um, a little uh, iPad, running an app, there was a lot of speculation that perhaps Hona were actually going to release some sort of cool harmonica-based app, which would be interesting. But what they've done isn't that at all, and it's much less exciting. For me, anyway, I'd like you to tell me what you think about it. So what they've done, they haven't made an app. What they've done is they've made a deal with the creators of an existing app called uh, Jam Zone. Jam Zone. <laughs> Ridiculous. And they are giving a 30-day free trial of Jam Zone away with all of their harmonicas in the same way that they do with bluesharmonica.com and they're not stopping so they're doing both so you're getting a free 30 days out of bluesharmonica.com and Jam Zone when you buy a new Hona harmonica which is kind of pretty sweet. So what is Jam Zone? Jam Zone. Oops, sorry. I was a bit very busy saying Jam Zone. And uh, should have let a truck pull out, but didn't. So what is Jam Zone? Jam Zone is one of these newfangled apps that aim to help musicians practice, learn, and perform. So it'll load up the chords to popular songs, it'll display them and it'll scroll by in a little sort of sing-along fashion. If you want to play guitar and learn the chords, um, there's all sorts of options for performing with it as well. You can actually load in your set list, which just seems baffling to me. And there are a lot of other cool features like changing the pitch, slowing down the music and loads of other things. It's a really useful tool for learning. But the thing is that this kind of software has been around for a good long while now. I'm always talking about the slowdown or it's a fantastic, incredibly useful bit of software that lets you slow down tracks, lets you repeat loops of a track, lets you export the process track so if you want a really slow version for practicing with you can do that it's just incredibly useful I use it all the time when I'm practicing and playing myself and I use it all the time for teaching as well I find it indispensable and I think I paid about whatever 30 quid for it back in the day and it's still trotting along the one thing that this jam zone thing seems to do though, and I have had a quick play with it, I've had a quick route around, but you may have detected already from my possibly less than rabidly enthusiastic approach to this that I'm not thrilled with it, but one very, very cool thing that it does is allows you to isolate single instrument tracks on recordings, so if there's a song with harmonica, and you want to play along, you can mute the harmonica in the song and play along as if there was no harmonica player there to begin with, which is awesome. Similarly, you can, if say there's a harmonica part in a song, you can mute all the other tracks and just have the harmonica track playing so that you can listen and learn from that. And that, I think, is a very, very cool thing, very useful, very immediately kind of Okay, I get that. that, that really makes sense to me. However, this thing, they are charging, uh, I think it's 9.99 a month, so English pounds, so 10 English pounds, and also what you can't do with it 
is loading your own tracks. So if a track that you want to learn doesn't have to happen to be in their library, and I think I've read they've got like 60,000 tracks or something. If the track you want to learn is not there, you're out of luck. No doubt the library will be growing all the time, but it's bound to happen. I'm not feeling it for a tenner a month. Certainly in the way that I would use it. I am aware, however, that there is a performance aspect to this thing. And I don't want to get into the whole, should people be using iPads on stage or not? To be honest, it's a different subject. And I think perhaps that ship has sailed already. It feels odd to me, but then I'm an old fart, you know, who's quite stuck in his ways. My two-year-old can find YouTube kids on an iPad, no bother. And he's memorized his mum's passcode. So it's gonna be second nature to generations sort of younger than mine, I suppose. If you do use apps and things to organize your set lists and keep your chord charts in, I've never found an app that I found more useful than a piece of paper for that purpose, to be perfectly honest. But like I say, that's me. And maybe I'm missing out because there's gotta be something in it. Anyway, so I'm not thrilled I'm not thrilled about it. I think typical Hona, they made a big song and dance about it and all they're doing is giving you a free trial to this subscription service, which may or may not be worth it. That said, if you look at the big picture or zoom out a little bit, it is good that Hona are helping new harmonica players to get access to quality learning information and tools. So they're doing bluesharmonica.com and this free subscription to Jam Zone. I mean, that's pretty cool. If you buy your first harmonica and you've got that, then you've got everything you need there to get kicked off with you, but way, way more than you need. And, th and that's a good thing, you know? If it helps people learn and it encourages people, then that's good. I mean, it's light years away from the little leaflet you used to get that tried to explain tongue blocking but uh, everyone completely ignored yeah not for me I don't think but I that feature of soloing out certain instruments is very very cool let me know what you do how you feel about it I'm just starting to feel very old now <laughs> although I'm fine with, I'm fine with tech I'm just whatever let me know how you feel about it if it's gonna be useful to you very very cool if you have having a free trial let me know how you get on with it if you already subscribe i'm fascinated to know what you should be getting out of it because it only seems to add complications for me but that's me and i'm very atypical all right i'm nearly where i need to be so i'm gonna say goodbye and i will see you again on tuesday for uh, life love and blues harmonica licks bye bye Jam Zone.